but what goes up must come down. <laughs> Our feet stick to the ground again. Mm -hmm. Good. I was starting to feel like a bubble. Oh. <laughs> hey, look, everybody. We're not alone up here. Oh, we're not? Whoa. <laughs> That's a space shuttle. Are there people on the space shuttle, Barney? Oh, there sure are. And here comes one of them now. It's a real astronaut. And the astronaut is heading this way. <laughs> our spaceship has a doorbell. Uh -huh. And our spaceship has a guest. <laughs> Hi, Ken. Hi, Barney. <laughs> Hi, kids. Everyone, I'd like you to meet my very good friend, Ken Reitler. Hi, everybody. <laughs> Nice spaceship you've got here, Barney. It's, well, very imaginative. Oh, thank you. <laughs> wow, I've never seen a real space suit before. It's pretty special, all right. And it does a lot of different things. When I have my helmet on, it gives me air to breathe. Out there in space, things can get very, very hot or very, very cold, but my spacesuit keeps me comfortable. What does that stand for? This says NASA. It stands for National Aeronautics and Space Administration. That's a very big name. Well, it's a pretty big job putting people into space, and we've been doing it for a long time. And if we all look at the view screen, we can see some of the things NASA has done. This is so great. <laughs> Ready, Gail? Ready. This rocket took some of the first American astronauts into space. It was room for only one person. Ooh, still I bet it was a little crowded inside. Yeah, yeah, it was <laughs> But in a few years, the rockets got bigger and they flew even farther. In fact, they were about to go a lot farther. All the way to the moon. Whoa! <laughs> well, that's right, Barney. This rocket flew all the way to the moon. And the astronauts even got to walk on the moon. That's one small step for man. One giant leap for mankind. Hey, that looks like fun. Yeah, it sure does. There were many other trips to the moon, and people learned a lot of new things about the moon. Oh, cool. Look. Today, we use a rocket called the Space Shuttle to take people and things into space. That looks like you, Mr. Reitler. Well, you're right, Robert. That is me on my second mission into space. Someday, we're going to go even farther. We're going to go to other planets, maybe even to the stars. Who knows? Maybe someday, you can be astronauts and have adventures of your own. I'd like to be an astronaut. Me too. Well, it looks like you're off to a pretty good start already. Just learn all you can in school and always use your imagination. We will. Well, Barney, I've got to get back to the shuttle. Oh, well, thanks for coming aboard, Ken. That was my pleasure. <laughs> thanks a lot. You guys have a good trip. I just love it when friends float in for a visit. And it was fun hearing about the moon. It would be so cool to walk on it. Well, I don't know about walking on it, but now that we're on our way again, we'll be passing the moon in just a little while. <laughs> What's that? Oh. Well, there must be 